The Philippine Navy PNS Prospective Missile Frigate, BRP Antonio Luna FF-151, will undergo a test of its communications system as part of its second sea acceptance trials this week. The test would be conducted off the waters of Ulsan, South Korea, PN Public Affairs Office Chief Lieutenant Commander Maria Cristina Roxas said in an interview with the Philippine news agency PNA Monday. Kong's communications testing will be on December 7 to 11 on Olsen waters, she added. This phase will involve testing the ship's communications system in various seagoing scenarios. Roxas said the first sea acceptance trials, held from November 30 to December 4, yielded satisfactory results. The first week of sea acceptance trial was completed with satisfactory results. The test conducted of the vessel performance, propulsion control, navigation systems, and auxiliary machinery, she added. More systems tests or trials are to be conducted in the coming weeks. She added that the third batch of Philippine Navy personnel, assigned to the BRP Antonio Luna, and scheduled for original equipment manufacturer, OEM, training have already arrived in South Korea on November 27 and are now observing their 14-day mandatory quarantine before starting their training. BRP Antonio Luna was launched on November 8, 2019 at the Olsen facility of South Korean shipbuilder Hyundai Heavy Industries. Its keel laying on May 23, 2019, coincided with the launch of BRP Jose Rizal. The contract for the BRP Jose Rizal and the BRP Antonio Luna was placed at 16 billion Philippine pesos with another 2 billion Philippine pesos for weapon systems and munitions. These ships are capable of conducting anti-air warfare AAW, anti-surface warfare ASUW, anti-submarine warfare ASW, and electronic warfare EW, operations. Earlier, Philippine Navy Chief Vice Admiral Giovanni Carlo Bacordo said the BRP Antonio Luna could have been delivered this October if not for the coronavirus disease 2019 COVID-19, pandemic. If not for this COVID-19 pandemic, the second frigate, FF-151, should have been delivered by October this year but because of this pandemic, it will be moved to the first quarter of calendar year 2021, he added in an online forum.